My name is Lynn Pfeiffer, and usually you can find me in my kitchen creating and sharing recipes. I'm the creator of the blog, 365 Days of Baking and More. As a home chef, I'm always exploring new ways to cook and prepare food. Today, Best Food Facts has invited me to bring my passion for food into a research lab. I'll be talking with Dr. Rodolph Barangu about CRISPR technology and its impact on food. I've, this is something completely new with a film crew and everything. This is the first time you go through that. Yeah. Oh, that's this cool. is... I tend to think of myself as a CRISPR expert and CRISPR enthusiast, as well as a food scientist. So tell me, what is CRISPR? CRISPR is an acronym, which stands for Clustered Regularly Interspaced Short Palindromic Repeats. So it's a very cumbersome name, arguably, but at the same time a very catchy and easy to remember acronym. What does CRISPR mean to me? Essentially, CRISPR-based technologies enable geneticists to edit DNA, to edit the genomes. And what genome editing is, is the ability to edit, much like an editor would edit text. You can change a letter, you can alter a word, you can change a sentence. CRISPR in many ways is a molecular scalpel that enables scientists to very selectively, very efficiently cut DNA. So you're a chef, I'm a food scientist, and CRISPR chef. So let's talk about food. That's your handle? That's my handle yeah. indeed. So when you're in your kitchen and you have all the ingredients on hand to make a masterpiece, right? You have a great recipe. In the middle of it, you realize there's a mistake. Maybe they got the temperature in the oven off. You're like, that's wrong. If I do that, something bad's gonna happen. I need to correct this. Much like somebody would correct a faulty genetic sequence. So you go in and erase and correct it. That's what geneticists do find a particular sentence that is unique in the book of life, in the DNA code of any particular cell, look for that mistake, and then replace this mistake and edit it out with this corrected version. And it's a question of when, not if. CRISPR-based technologies solve the biggest challenge of medicine. Things like curing HIV, curing muscular dystrophy, curing cancer. What do you say to people that are concerned about gene editing? I think CRISPR is a great example of something that is extremely powerful and we need to make sure that we are responsible enough, cautious enough, and enabling enough to unravel the great potential of that technology. That's amazing. That's the power of CRISPR. After visiting with Dr. Barangu, it amazes me that they can be so precise in cutting and editing genes to make them better. CRISPR technology could be the answer to everything from food allergens to genetic diseases. The potential for this is mind-blowing. We'll be exploring how it can affect human health in our next segment. So until then, I'm Lynn Pfeiffer for Best Food Facts.